What's going down guys? TK coming at you with the wild hair day. <laughs> you know, I, 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 I come at you guys with uh, different insights and my uh, desire with uh, perspective and insight is that it hits someone, makes them think, and hopefully influences somebody to do something to protect their finances. Uh, some people wonder, like, why do you keep doing what you're doing? <laughs> why do you try to help people? You know, I answered that in a uh, Facebook post. I said, uh, the answer to that question is I help because uh, I hope that it influences somebody in a positive way. Simply as that. Um, you know, when you look at uh, history and you go back in time, it gives you a point of reference for uh, what happened or what could happen in the future because nature tends to run in cycles. So if you don't read history, if you don't go back in time, then you don't have a point of reference for the future. And then I think that the nature of uh, the processed food that we consume and the degree that the uh, television influences and controls your actions and thoughts it, it sort of zombie-like or, or transfers or the mindset, the frequencies that you operate on vibrate very lowly. So when you vibrate on lower frequencies, it prevents you from um, higher aspects of your personality. The higher aspects of your personality get shut off you're operating on minimal uh, vibration. Your, your, your frequency vibrations are so low that um, the superior side of you is turned off. And that might be the reason why it's hard to influence somebody to accept the state of the economy, to see the nature of the changes that are going on within our economic system to pay attention to the worldwide systems that are not only failing but shifting but I mean all of that points to and boils down to one thing and one thing only and that is that in the economic shift that's taking place right now there is going to be a major wealth transfer where uh, money is devalued in the hands of the people who uh, have it right now, the general public, and then revalued in another format. Because I said this before, and history proves this to be true, that money never dies, it transfers from one medium to another. And in that transfer, there's always a revaluation. So the spread between the value of paper money in the hands of the public that's going down and the appreciation and money that, or alternative money that no one really has their hands on except for a 1% small few, that revaluation is uh, a, a huge spread. And what it equates to is the biggest um, transfer of wealth in human history. Because this is the first time that a fail is not local, the fail is worldwide. Uh, the, U.S. dollar is the world reserve currency, so 
if the value of the dollar falls to the point where it tips the critical statistical scale, then it takes down everyone who's pegged to the dollar, right? But that also takes down the paper derivatives that are spinoffs from the dollar. What are we seeing right now in other economies? We're seeing economies that are pegged to commodities uh, fall, right? You know, we have examples, but no one's paying attention to the writing this on the wall. So, somebody asked me today, they said, um, you know, based on you paying attention to the economy, what uh, are you putting your money into? I said, well, I always suggest to people that they pull their money out of paper derivatives and put it into alternative currency. And the two alternative forms of money that I put my conversion into is gold currency and uh, cryptocurrency, Bitcoin 2.0. So those are the two areas that I suggest that other people put their money because that's where I'm putting my money. And what I always say in my videos is that uh, if you want me to walk you through the conversion process that I've already done, then I can show you uh, I can show you what that is. So, I'll leave you guys with that. It's a personal choice to empower yourself with alternative currency. Alternative currency is the uh, asset-backed money that isn't um, manipulated in the same way that paper money is manipulated so it behooves you to participate in alternative currency <laughs> that's all I can really say I hope that some of you guys listen and I hope that some of you guys open up a free account and begin to pull your money out of paper 